A little girl with a big heart, making a difference one pair of shoes at a time. Size 12. Seven-year-old Anaya saw a friend at school in need. I noticed his shoes um, were broken, and he said, these are the only shoes I had. Now, her mission this summer, to get enough shoes to help all the kids at her school who need them. What a great story. And we've got Anaya and Marlene Daly joining us live here in studio this morning. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning, Anaya. Thanks for being with us. Anaya is a little shy, but what she's done, you would think, I mean, this is just amazing, Mom. Tell me about this because she's only seven, but she had the heart to know, I want to help. Yes, she uh, is very generous. Yes. So she was chatting with a friend at school. And she observed that his shoes were kind of in bad condition. So she asked him, what, what's wrong with your shoes or why do your shoes look like that? And he said those are the only pair he had. Mm. So she came home and told dad about it. And she said she wanted to buy him a pair of shoes. So she wanted to buy that one pair of shoes. And so you start off with one. Yes. But then it seemed to just kind of explode. How did that happen? Once we bought the boy the shoes, yeah. he was happy to receive them. And there was another little boy who saw her give him the gift, and the little boy said, oh, I wish I had a pair. Aww. So when she came home to let us know about that, we then decided to start a shoe drive. And look at all of the shoes that you have here. Anaya, do you know how many shoes that you have collected for these kids who need shoes so far? Um. 100. 100? How does it make you feel to know that you are helping all of these kids in need? Happy. It makes you feel happy? You feel like you're doing a really good thing? Yes. What is the best part about this? When you gave the shoes to that little boy, what did he say to you? He said thank you. And when he said thank you, how did that make you feel? Happy. And what do you hope happens now? Look at all these shoes that you've collected. What do you hope happens now? Um, that everyone in need will buy these shoes. You hope everybody in the world gets a pair of shoes. I think it's so amazing. And where do you think she got this spirit of giving from, Mom? Huh? Well, her father and I, we're very generous. We love to give and to be able to just be a, a blessing to others. Always great to be a blessing to somebody mm -hmm. else in need. What yes. happens now? Because you've got these shoes here. What happens to all of these shoes? Because what I heard was now you have more need than you have shoes. Exactly. Uh, right now we're looking to give some shoes away at her, our, her elementary school. Okay. And also we have a church where they're doing a back to school drive mm -hmm. so we will be distributing shoes as well but we didn't only leave it for children we okay. now want to collect for all so we have men and women and you know moms and dads who may need a little help and we're looking forward to see what else so we are we are accepting donations used new where can where can people donate where can they find you if they want to find out more information about what you're doing or if they want to donate shoes themselves um they can email me at ava d shoebox mm -hmm. at yahoo.com mm -hmm. or they can find me on facebook marlene daily and then they can get some more information i am working on a website because i had a couple of people ask mm -hmm. and you know it's surprising because i didn't expect it to get so much attention so that's my that's my next plan and so with this what do you hope happens ultimately because this is local now but i could see something like this going regionally going nationally is that where you see this going because there's so absolutely. many people in need yeah. you, you do see this going absolutely yes bigger than what it we're, is now. we're looking to start with our community first and as you know donations come in we'll be able to distribute more and as long as the flow keeps on coming in then we'll send to other states as well oh, what a great thing Anaya you have done a really good thing I'm just so proud of you and you're cute too that doesn't hurt either is that dad over there as well <laughs> dad hi dad you guys have raised a wonderful little girl here thank all you. right thank you guys for being with us certainly thank do you. appreciate what you are doing thank let's you. get on over to Jamie now who's got a look at our weather morning